My right hand, hand and seven eight times. What what conclusions did you come to? Okay? Would you phrase it like this? I drew the conclusion. Do you like that? Okay. Ready? So help me. Raise your hand. Who can I know you talk to your partner. What conclusions did you draw about those characters? What what conclusions? What did you come up with? Because we didn't have any words, okay? Right? The author, we know the author of those pictures of Mrs. Butch. So what what conclusion? We had two characters in there. Um, right? We're gonna call one character Cody, we're gonna call one character Sarah. Davina, what conclusions did you draw? Sarah is nice. Ready? She's I drew. I drew that the, Sarah. I drew the conclusion good. that Sarah is nice. She's friendly. Well, why? How? Well, what Sarah's evidence nice did you use? Because she was picking up Cody that he fell down and he was do probably doing something that he wasn't supposed to do. Oh, so you drew the conclusion that Cody was being guilty, okay? Absolutely. You can draw that conclusion, okay? Nice. Somebody else. What conclusions did you draw about those two characters in our book? You can't answer because you're the character. You know that character better than anybody else. Madison, what'd you draw? Uh, I can draw. Madison, one second. Hey guys, if you're on my bench, just hold on those fell, okay? I don't want you to flip over. You drew the conclusion nice. I drew the conclusion. But Sarah was helpful. That this character in our story is helpful. Okay. I can agree with that, but it doesn't say just tell me about it. It says give me evidence, whether you're using the words or the pictures. What did you see or what do you know that told you she was helpful? She was helping Cody out. Good. She was helping Cody. Now, we can, we can do this with pictures, which is absolutely fabulous.